November 15th, 2012, this is Tech Raw. How you guys doing? Good. I'm yeah, good. I'm good. 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 I'm good. Good. We're all good. <coughs> Call of Duty came out. Yes. Wow, wow, wow. I don't know if anyone heard. <laughs> Where's kinda, my sound effects at? <laughs> <laughs> kind of got a funny story. I, uh, it came out uh, with, with Tuesday. Yeah, Tuesday night. Okay, it was coming to the house. I had the tracking number and everything. Well, it was already loaded on the truck to come out. Yeah. I knew it was coming. So yeah. I told my boss, I was like, look, I ain't even going to lie to you. I was like, there's a game that came out today. I really want to play it. I was like, I want to take the rest of the day off. So he was cool with it. He's like, all right. And then he asked yep. me what game. So I was like, Call of Duty. And then we kind of got into this discussion about a game that I honestly don't think he knows anything about. <laughs> That's awesome. Like, oh, yeah. But, uh... Yeah. But so I get home, you know, and I, I boot it up and I play it. And I only play it for, it was only a couple hours, really. I really tried to dig into that zombie mode. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm not yeah. I'm not feeling it, man. It's just like, even before, like, all Call of Duties, they have, like, the one map, you know, that starts out. And then I think if you, like, the last Black Ops, after you finished it, you got to fight in the White House and, like, uh, you know, the War Room and shit, which was cool. That's just like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I never beat the last Call of Duty campaign. I beat was Call of Duty Four. That's only uh, back in like oh nine ten. Xbox Live was down, so I had to do something. So I yeah. beat the campaign. Oh, that so you didn't finish Black down. Ops Two? Yeah, dude, nope. it's not bad. It's it's the story's pretty good actually. It's just um, god damn, it's like playing a cutscene, you know. It's yeah. like left trigger, right trigger, shoot, you know, and it's, uh, you know, but I've, I've heard this one. The second one's a little better. They've, uh, they've got it so, like, you make decisions through the game, and you yeah. don't really realize you're doing it, and it affects the story. Kind of like RPGs? Yeah, kind of <laughs> yeah. like that, but not, not as advanced, but it's, uh, yeah. it's not like, okay, it's not like they say, okay, well, you're going to shoot this guy, or you're going to let him live. You know, that stuff's obvious. You know, you know yeah. you're making a decision there. Uh -huh. And um, from what I understand, there may be one or two of like that. But there's also ones where you have to, like, a chase, chase a guy down. And if you catch him, you know, you catch him, the story will go one way. But if you miss him and he gets away, it's cool to go a different direction. Yeah. Which is kind of cool. I'm into that. But, like, I've only played, uh, what was it? I don't know if you haven't done the campaign either, Stinky. No, dude, all I played was multiplayer. I mean, I'm 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 a campaign guy to kind of because the reason why I play a campaign is just the same reason you play, just to familiarize. I mean, I know the buttons, but yeah. when when new games come out, they almost kind of tweak some things sometimes, like. I remember it doesn't feel like this. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. don't you get that feeling sometimes? So that's well, you why also I play got... Sorry, the campaign. Sorry. That's why I play the campaign yeah. is to feel, familiarize myself before I jump online. Yeah, like most of the uh, shooting games have the same button layout too, like Gears of War, Battlefield, Call of Duty, Medal of Honor, Beast Approach, right trigger to shoot, left trigger to zoom in. It's pretty much yeah. the same thing around. So it's familiarizing yourself with the game, but it's also the same button layout, so it's easier for you to realize how the back. If you guys remember back in like PS1, PS2 days, you played SOCOM, then you go play like uh, Spec Ops, the button layout was moved around, like it was totally flipped. Yeah. Sony's like weird it. like that, though. It's just like Metal Gear. Uh, when you play a Metal Gear game, normally, like when you play any other game, it's X to start. And it's yeah. so in a Metal Gear game. It threw me off. It threw me off for. Like crazy, mm -hmm. I'd, I'd hit X and it would go back. You know, yeah. it's, it's the back button, yeah. But like at the Call of Duties, they got two different studios making them every year, so they change it up. It's just like I think now you can dive to prone, which you couldn't do. Call of Duty, what was it the third Modern Warfare? They took it out. Are you yeah, guys still yeah. on here? Oh, okay, all right. Yeah, Stinky, man. Stinky was just like looking down. I thought the computer froze on me. No, it, was, <laughs> um, it was like that was that was what the big thing was was the. Um, you know, it was like a trick shot. They called it the dolphin dive. You know, yeah. it was one of the things yeah. that you just jump and then dive and shoot and kill or whatever. But now that you can, you know, Metal of Honor is that way. Is it? I, you know, now really? that I play Metal of Honor, 
I really appreciate what they do with the game because you can run and slide and sh actually shoot into prone. You know what I mean? Really? They can't do that on Call of Duty. You can actually run and um, crouch and slide on your knees and shoot. Really? That's yeah, cool. man. Like, I mean, it's... But I, I understand what you're saying, Eric. I really do. I really do because... Um, <clears throat> This, they sometimes tweak something, like they enhance something else that you really don't care about, but it sometimes almost screws with the controls just a little bit. Yeah. Like I know on Call of Duty Black Ops 1, the original yeah. one, I played on Sensitivity 8. Really? I oh, wow. Oh, man, I play, man, I play. I get nauseous. Yeah. I can't do that. Yeah, I dude. can't do it. I can't play on three or four. That's too fucking. Oh, four is mine. That's my sweet spot. <laughs> yeah. That's it. Yeah, I, I, I I've been playing. I play uh, on nine or yeah. Eight or nine. Oh man, that'd make me dizzy. I wouldn't know where to stop. Of course, like it does have Dude, that auto yeah, lock. I don't know. Like that. Does, uh, can you turn that off? Is that a feature you can just turn off auto? Lock? I know. Yeah. Yeah. Because uh, you can turn that off and on. Because that makes the game go a little quicker. Like right now, I'm just playing the campaign to get through it. Um, yeah. It's not mm -hmm. nothing's really grabbed me yet, but I've heard it's really good. It just it hasn't. Is. It hasn't really got me it. yet. Um, I just I'm on the because it bounces back and forth from like 1984 yeah, or five to 2525, and it's kind of really? cool to see the progression. Yeah, and especially if you played the first one all the way through, you know yeah. the characters because they're all the same. Um, and I'm like halfway through the uh, the future, the second level that I'm on. It's it takes place in the future, mm. and. Uh, the weapons are pretty cool. I was kind of hoping for more like GI Joe laser weapons. Yeah, you know, I, futuristic, I, right? Yeah, you know, I, but it's they're bullets. But they have like a like when he throws a grenade. He doesn't throw a grenade. He just kind of sticks his arm out and yeah, it shoots like out of this device. Um, oh, is that like the multiplayer? Do they have that on there? It's a, it yeah, takes place in the future, it, it, doesn't it? Yeah. yeah it, I was like, I threw my grenade. I'm like, what is this? I'm a softball girl playing like the first <laughs> yeah. side throw. I'm like, yeah. I went yeah. five, five feet in front of me. I killed myself. I'm like, what? <laughs> I jump and throw like other Call of Duty goes like twenty yards. This one's like ten yards. Yeah. And the other thing that caught me off guard was the uh, Type ninety five. If you guys never played Modern Warfare three, it was a three three shot burst. We, yeah. we, this mm -hmm. one's like not three shot burst. This is like if you hold the trigger down, it's going full auto. Really? I mean, you I can't like, change like, it? No, but I like it this way. I was like, oh, okay. I, I unlocked it, and I'm like, oh, do I want to play around with it? But th that, that's the thing, too, Stink. I'm not saying that you're wrong, but I did hear that they finally implemented um, the uh, rate of fire. Like, you can actually push down on the, down on the D-pad, and it, you can go from three-round burst to single shot or to auto. Yeah, on certain. See, that's guns. what I thought it was. I yeah. thought that you could do that, or yeah, yeah. you could either do yeah, that or put that in there. on the grenade launcher. It's uh, it's also got uh, like I like the loadout thing better because it's like ten. You know, you have ten slots. So yeah. if you don't want a secondary, you don't want a pistol or anything like that, you take that away and you can add another perk. And that's that's beautiful, want. man. Or I'm, you can I'm, take out all the perks and just have a knife fight. Yeah, I'm not hate. I'm not hating on the game. I know. I'm not hating on the game. But Why not? That, <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, I'm getting well, ready to. <laughs> fucking finally got it together. Yeah, they did. I it's was, better. I, you know, it's it's the way you want it set up. I'm I'm just not a fan of playing perked out. But they do have you know rooms for that, like core or bare bones and stuff. Yeah, like I like that, bare which bones. Is, that's that's where I play. No perks, no fucking, you know, under barrels, no sights, no nothing, just you and your gun. Yeah. yeah. Who can pull the trigger faster? That's all it's about. You know what I mean? I don't get into perks and all oh, the fucking Apache helicopter. You got 10 kills and here comes your, your kill streak yeah. and all this shit. I mean, it yeah. makes it damn near impossible to play. You know? This Call, this call of Duty is point yeah. streak, not kill streak. Well, See, after, after Battlefield, like. though, it's it's impossible to play Call of Duty. For me, it's impossible to get on there and like after actually enjoy myself in a match of Call of Duty online. Like it's, ah, god damn, it's just like you don't. Where's the fucking? Where is the tanks? Where's the fucking explode? You know, it's just running around. It's like paintball. You're just fucking. Basically. You know, I'm give me something. <laughs> this is not a battle. You know. Yeah. It's a, yeah. yeah. Exactly. But they, paintball. They should. Uh, they should implement that. They should. No, I mean, but like, and it's not changed. Yeah. yeah. True. 
I think it affects the graphics, uh, you know, because the graphics really, the cutscenes and stuff look good, um, but everything looks the same. I mean, the, the hardware and the, the consoles and stuff are now are, they're just getting aged, man. They've been out since 2005, yeah. Yeah. you know, 2006 for the PlayStation, and yeah. they're just getting old. They can't, you know, they, I think they've pushed it as far as they can. I would be surprised to see another game, you know, within the next year that actually like wows me as far as graphics. Now I've heard Halo Four looks pretty good. Oh my goodness! I heard it looks good. I could talk the whole show about that game. I'm, well, let's, I'm, let's let's talk a little bit about it. Yeah, go ahead, Claude. Tell us what you like about it. <laughs> what I like about it is um, I haven't touched a Halo game since Halo Two. Okay. Yeah, Ten, Ten eight, eight years ago. <laughs> you know, I really haven't. Um, but. Uh, the storyline with Master Chief coming back and that um, the Prometheans, jeez, mm. the yeah, there you go, Prometheans, mm. yeah, wow, those motherfuckers are hard to take down. Are they? Yeah, they got like a hovering, reviving thing that actually shoot at you, and they if you shoot and kill a Promethean like alien, like that thing revives them and brings them back to life. But as far as the graphics. The game mechanics, the controls, they actually have a control called Fish Sticks that, um, right that uh, Jay actually told me about because I was lost. And I put the controller in my hand because you had to click the right stick in to zoom. Yeah. You had to shoot yeah. this, and then the left, the left trigger, the left sight, which would be, you know, look down your sight, was um, grenade, and this one was armor, and the buttons were all fucked up. So I was like, you know yeah. what I mean? And he told well, me about he told me about the layout, and it's just like Battlefield. I was like, oh my god! Oh, you're talking about like changing it up, like yeah, not, yeah, okay, the, yeah, uh, yeah. Because yeah, I forgot you had to click to zoom in Halo. It's oh my played god. Halo Reach, and uh, <laughs> I played it, man. You know, it's like it's like Call of Duty. It's like Halo. It's just they're the same games, but it's a different studio that did Halo Four. So, uh, three four three four three three four three, three I think is yeah. what it is yeah, and um, you know they were supposed to kind of take it in a different direction. There's supposed to be a whole new trilogy coming they up. They did man. They did take it a different direction because now you kind of get a care package, and I'm not going to say where they got that from. It's not really called a care package. It's called uh, it's called something else. Like you, it gets sent down to you. Like you can mm-hmm. pick a sniper rifle. You can yeah. pick armor and stuff like that. Which, mm, yeah, it's not bad. It's a switch up. It's a change up. But you guys have built a fan base around what you guys have been doing for years. Mm-hmm. Why switch it now? I know there's always time for change, but some things don't need to be messed with. You know what I mean? Yeah. I think they wanted to put their mark on it. You know, it's yeah. it's they have they're probably under a lot of pressure to you know because hey, hey that's a that that is a staple game. It is. You know, ever since the first Xbox, you know, and uh, Bungie's been doing it ever since. Mm-hmm. So I, I think a different studio did Halo Wars. Uh, I'm not for sure, but that was a completely different game. Yeah, one. I didn't, I didn't play that one either. Um, but you know, Bungie said, "I see ya. We want to do our own thing. We're tired of Halo." So they handed it over to 343, mm. and I think they remade. They're the ones that remade like the Halo Anniversary one, where they updated the graphics. And yeah, stuff. yeah, and Jay was telling me about that too. I actually need to go grab that. I saw that at Walmart for twenty bucks. Oh really? Well, I pick it up for yeah. twenty dollars. I'd play Halo again. Yeah. And it's got multiplayer now on it. But see, the thing about that, I'm gonna stop you there. Because okay. PlayStation's Halo is Killzone. I don't know if you guys agree with me with that. No. Tra- yeah, that's what they were attempting. It was okay. supposed to be like a Halo killer. Exactly. Yeah. And Halo is of course Xbox's kill zone for PlayStation. Mm, that's their so, Mario. Okay. Yeah. Right. <laughs> so when Killzone, and Stinky told me this a couple months back, when Killzone did the trilogy, when they came out with the one, the two, and the three, all in this bundle pack, you know how Drake's Fortune, Devil May Cry did one, two, and three, and then yeah. Metal Solid did their little package deal. Killzone did that. But when Killzone came back up with Killzone 1, that was on PS2, just mm-hmm. like Halo was on Xbox, the original Xbox, it got that, you know, that High definition, 720 facelift, and all that stuff. It's basically the basically almost the same thing. You know what I mean? Because it's just like Killzone did it, 
but Halo did it, but I'm not sure which one did it first. Yeah, did I don't X, know. I'm you know, not did sure. Xbox, you know, yeah. do remake the Halo one all over again to be able to be played on the newest console? I gotta grab that. I think it was a cash grab. I think it was a test yeah. probably for that studio. Okay. Um, you know, they probably already were in development of Halo Four because I think they announced it last year, mm-hmm. and uh, it was probably just probably to get things going. Now I don't know if they redid the engine, but I know you know they obviously had to do something for updating the graphics and right. adding multiplayer. And, and uh, I think they took out. Did, can you dual wield in four? What call it? Call what? it no. Uh, uh, Halo. I haven't I played online that. yet. No, I mean just in the game. Can you pick up two weapons at once and 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 how hold them both in your hands? No. Because that was the big seen. thing with Halo 2. You know, we can fucking dual wield now. Master Chief can hold a shotgun and a fucking wow. pistol. All in your yeah. grill. But you know one thing I do like? I don't know if they had this in, like I said, I haven't played since Halo 2. Is they have a, uh, uh, a hologram. Yeah. Oh, my God, dude. <laughs> I use that shit all the time. I don't even yeah. use my armor. <laughs> I use the hologram like you can actually press the left bumper and it sends a hologram and you can go the other direction and kind of flank the enemies. I mean it's crazy. I like that. I like that part of the aspect of the game. And the fucking guns on there. Oh, the shatter shot, the Promethean rifle and stuff like that. Oh, powerful bro. I'm talking about one shot kills. No, really. Yeah. Now, doesn't this like attach itself to the other weapon, and there's like some cutscene that goes on? When it yeah, that? yeah, yeah. Okay. It does. Right. It does kind of like all that. transform, like a like a transformer. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Kind of does that. It's pretty cool. <laughs> well, that's awesome. Uh, did you? Well, fuck. Maybe I should pick it up. I don't know, man. Uh-oh. Between the two. Uh-oh. Between the two. Uh, I, 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 I wish I, I had a got. I almost honestly wish I'd got Halo Four. Ooh. Over the two. Wow. So, that's a yeah. kill. Yeah. <laughs> I honestly, I the reason why I'm not a big Halo person, and I was, I respect you guys, so I let you guys talk about Halo. Mm-hmm. I have no well, problem. I, with, that. I have no problem with Halo. Now the stinky speaks. Ah, uh, I just don't like like I played Halo Three like, like back in high school, oh eight, oh nine, yeah. with some with some buddies. I I bought it and I try to play it. I just couldn't stand like unloading my gun on some dude and having him turn around, boom, dead. Like really? Yeah. yeah. Like I just I like the future. Like I want one shot kill or two shot kill. Not oh, you can unload your whole gun on me and I'm gonna turn around and shoot you and kill you in one shot. Like really? Yeah. I hear what you're saying because I don't. I've I've said this before. I I'm not a big fan of the multiplayer. I'm, I, I like the co-op. I love uh, multiplayer on any game really because mm-hmm. like anymore it's just. Overkill. Let's just see how who shoots first, you know, or yeah, yeah. Uh, you know, I guess that's why I liked Battlefield. There's so many different variables in in that game, yeah. you know. Right. It's uh, there's so many different things to do in that game, uh, like the Halos and the Call of Duties and all the other ones that come out are yeah. just okay. Here's your map. It may be an awesome map and the, it may look great. Here's your map. Here's some guns. Go, you yeah. know, uh, and. That's why uh, I'm playing Call of Duty now, and mm-hmm. it's like playing a blockbuster summer movie. <laughs> and it's fun to watch. It, it's it is fun to watch, but it like is. I feel it's like I don't have I feel like I don't have control because like well, I started playing it and I played through this about half of the second mission, and I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna play I'm gonna play Borderlands too because like <laughs> wow. Borderlands too. Wow. Like I feel like I have I have more control. You know, it's uh, of, of the environment. You know what I'm saying? Like you're right. In Call of Duty, if if a plane's gonna blow up, it's scripted. Yeah, you're so, right. So like bro. for the most part, like it's saying, okay, yeah. hurry up, hurry your ass up, and get there. And plant the bomb. But <laughs> you don't right. have to. You know, you're you right. can take your fucking time. You just look around, look at the graphics, look at the fucking sprites, check out, see if there's any fucking you know tearing in the game, and uh, it's just like hurry the fuck up. You know, got a a fucking plane. You know, it's taking off. Hurry up. Uh, You know, but it's Eric. You got good points there because you kind of feel like because when I played back Black Ops two, Black Ops one, there was actually um, and and I love everybody needs to know I am a fan of Ice Cube and Ice Cube actually did the voiceover for that guy. Yeah, that uh, was in the game. Remember? Yeah, and they left. They actually left the bar. And remember, they left the bar, and they, it was just a street. And I think they got in a car or something, 
You had to do the car scene. Yeah. But you had to go that way. Mm-hmm. You had to go that way. And when I played Battlefield Bad Company 2 and when I played Battlefield 3, playing the campaign mode, there was actually places that you can actually shoot the window out, crawl mm-hmm. through the window, jump over the desk, flank them from this side, go upstairs, shoot from a, shoot from a window. And in Call of Duty, it's just like, no, you have yeah, to go for it. Way. Yeah. It's like playing, like, I think I said this a couple weeks ago on one of our old podcasts, remember, like, Goldeneye, like, on the yeah. N64. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You, you kill the same guy over and over and over again. Yeah. He's coming because you, you, they have no other way to have him attack you. <laughs> right. You know, and that's that's the AI, though. You yeah. know, Stinky brings up a point, and I'm not sure if that's exactly what he meant, but it reminded me of something that I wanted to talk about. Mm-hmm. It's, uh, for example, like, I can say Borderlands because I've been playing a lot of it. You okay. have a set number of enemies. Really? Oh, okay? yeah. yeah. And in Battle, or not Battlefield, but in Call of Duty, they keep <clears> fucking coming. You know, until yeah. you get to this point on the map. Right, yep. And you got to keep moving, because if you don't keep moving, the yeah, motherfuckers yeah. are still coming. Yeah. You just, it's like, it's, I it's killed just 50 It's just infinite spawn of enemies, yeah. 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 It, right. And I understand some parts, like the beginning of Call of Duty Black Ops 2, you're in this uh, big open field, I think it's, I'm not sure exactly where it's at, it looked like Africa. Okay. But it's, yeah, uh, Africa. it's a yeah, huge, no. huge battle, and that I understand. But, you know, there's other parts where you, you're at an enemy base, and you're thinking, how many motherfuckers are here? <laughs> sure, yeah. You know? Right. You, 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 have like, you have like 10 bullets. You're like, you got to choose wisely. Like, Who yeah. I shoot? <laughs> yeah. See, like, like, oh, sorry. No, go ahead, man. That's, uh, all I was going to say was that's why yeah. I play those games on easy. <laughs> Me too. Fuck that. I just want to see the story. Yeah. You know? yeah. I'm not interested in, in, in getting an achievement on, like, what is it, veteran? Yeah, you know? I'll try that Like, oh, yeah. Into it. Yeah. Eric spent fucking five hours on a level trying to pass it, you know, on veteran, and he got an achievement. You know, yeah. you fucking deal. Yeah. You know, it, and I don't know. A lot of kids, a lot of the younger kids, care about that shit. It seems like you know, it's like, oh, I get comments too. You know, All right. yeah. especially you know, I'll get I'll get a like my friend. Uh, he'll he'll send me a message like easy. What the fuck? <laughs> you know, <laughs> and, you like, know that's 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 bad that uh, your. Your Xbox Live account actually shows. Yeah, right? I wish it wouldn't do that. Actually, and PlayStation started doing that shit too. Like after that last update, I saw yeah. somebody playing on Easy. I'm like, you playing on Easy? Pussy. <laughs> hey, oh, that's it, me. Does it does that's it show me. that? Yeah, it does. <laughs> yeah, I, I, dude, life is too. F- life is so full of fucking disappointment and stress. I don't need it anymore. I want to feel like Rambo. All right, yeah. I want to go in there and kick everyone's ass. Yeah, I want to yeah. take fifty bullets and be all right. You yeah. know, I agree with you. Yeah, but so right. so stinky. You do like the game, the multi. I I do. I just I never got into single player. I can't. Mm-hmm. If it's not objective, like I know you gotta play the single player, but I just like the multiplayer. I paid. I for mean, Xbox eventually Live. it just might come down to that because I know yeah. there was a game that came out. Um... So calm, so calm for the PS3 confrontation. Was strictly multiplayer. Yeah, was strictly years. multiplayer. Then you had another game that came out for PS3. Damn, what the hell was that game called? Um, you... Warhawk was that right? Um, Warhawk's one of them. That's the Tom Clancy, isn't it? No, that's maybe. Hawk. That's what Hawk. am I thinking Warhawk. of? Then uh, is it Warhawk? It, it's yeah. it's a shooter. It's yeah. a shooter, but you can play up to like sixty four people in a match. That's oh, how I know what you're talking was. about, too. God damn it. Um, I had that game and I took yeah, it. Yeah, I can't it remember. I, I can't remember <laughs> off the top of my head because it's a PlayStation game. But uh, I know what you're talking yeah. about. I know it's. Uh, well, did Mag. you play it? Mag. 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 There you yes. go. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> I was gonna drive me crazy. People. Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, that game was like horribly like. As soon as you spawn, bam, you were dead. As soon as you spawn, bam, you were dead. But the fucking games lasted like an hour and a half long, bro. Really? You play it? That many people? Yeah, I played it and I took it back. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I, I go through the comments and we okay. have uh, little Kwame saying, What's up, guys? What's, What's up? going on, buddy? And uh, he want, like, I was just talking to him before we started. He's like, I want to be a part of the show. And I told him, It's up to you guys. I'm like, well, I'm one of them happy to have him on here. Well, a little call me? Yeah. A little call yeah, me. Yes. We'll watch our language a little bit. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. We already know how bad your father is at video right? games. 
<laughs> and I, uh, Hoonigan says, you're welcome about the Halo 4 stuff. Yes, yes, he did hook me up with that. He did and, tell uh, me. Oh, sorry. He did, I mean, he just told me, go with my heart. And, you know, I'm just an alien freak. I love aliens, and <laughs> I'm pleased. And uh, Justin, yeah. says, Justin says hi. Hello. What's up, buddy? But now I'm fucking... You know, now I'm kind of regretting it because oh, see, if I'd have waited, do if I'd have waited, man. Okay, here's my ding. I paid uh -oh. fucking, I paid sixty dollars for the game. Okay. Okay, and I paid ten dollars to get it delivered to my door. That was convenient, so I wouldn't have to go out to the store, uh -huh. and I'd be home, and I can just play this some bitch. Um, and I don't know. I just don't. I don't. Fuck. I just wish. I wish I'd have waited. You said that like, last time. Okay, because like, Call of Duty. What, didn't yeah, you? it's it's. I don't fucking learn. Yeah. <laughs> but I waited. Um, it's, I, I a, did, it's a post buy. Yeah, I waited for uh, Modern Warfare Three though, and I'm glad I did because uh, I didn't even finish that one. I finished all of them with the exception did of the third one. one. Yeah, I did. Yeah, it's the set pieces. Oh, the set pieces were fucking yeah, like. like it's, he threw it's, up. Well, <laughs> 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 it's all like burping up popcorn. <laughs> no, popcorn and coke. Yeah, there you yeah, go. Yeah. Oh, it sounded, uh, it sounded very liquidy explode. there. It's like, what? Dude, yeah, I don't feel good. <laughs> so, me saying that I, I, I'm not crazy about Call of Duty kind of leads into this next thing is because, uh, you know, I said I left work early. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Play it. Okay, well. I woke up about two o'clock in the morning and I had a case of the stinkies. I I could not that I was on that toilet about every ten to fifteen minutes. Damn. And I'm still I'm still having problems. Okay. Is it, is it not a, not to get into my bowels on the show, <laughs> but I'm, I was having problems, all right. So I went to go to work that morning. I left at four thirty in the morning because I gotta be there yeah. at five. So I get about eh, it's about ten minute drive to get to the interstate from where I live. I about hit the interstate, and it hits me again. I'm like, oh, shit. Oh, shit. So oh, shit. Got, the gas stations are off the side. Well, the gas station's closed, of course. Yeah. <laughs> so I had to turn around. So I'm thinking, right, what the fuck? <laughs> so I, I said, fuck it. I called in. <laughs> I said, I called my boss. I sent everyone an email from my phone. I was like, I've been on the commode all night long. I was like, this has nothing to do with a video game. I made, <laughs> oh, okay. I right, made right. a point the day before saying I want to go home and play the game. I was honest. I was like, that's why I'm leaving. I was like, I fuck, you know, I ain't gonna lie to you. That's yeah. it. Yeah. And so uh, the next morning, everyone's coming in. They're like, oh fuck, Eric's one of them guys. Call of Duty holiday. <laughs> yeah. I, I swear to God, it wasn't. I I played maybe I didn't a half see you hour. Online. I didn't I played, see you online. I, I know. I played a half hour of the campaign. And uh, you know that's that's no lie. Uh, you look at the achievements, and then I turned it off, and then I played a little bit of Borderlands, and then I took my ass to bed because I was fucking tired. All that pooping fucking oh. wears you out. <laughs> I'm not a I'm not a spring chicken anymore, man. <laughs> <laughs> fucking <laughs> sitting let's, on the let's, toilet, let's, fucking let's, crying. Let's, let's, let's change the subject to, to video games, please. Oh well, I was I was actually playing a game while I was on the toilet. Oh, what God. the fuck? <laughs> How are you doing that? I'm the baby. fucking TV in there. How was you pooping? You pooping. <laughs> you what are you doing? Yeah. What are you doing? So what did you do? You you open the door and you sat on the toilet sideways and you played like this? No, what? man. I had the iPad. I had my hand. I was just... Oh, that's why oh I really don't... God. That's why no one wants to borrow my iPad. You don't know where that's oh been. Oh, my God. <laughs> wow. That, that, that iPad in more places. Yeah, if that you. iPad could talk. Yeah. Wow. Um, no, man, it's You'd be, so like I came into work this morning mm -hmm. and everyone's like, mm -hmm. "Yeah, sick, huh?" And I'm like, "I swear to God, I swear, <laughs> swear to God." I was like, yeah. "I, I it's know." It's only when you're being honest, you're yeah. being, you know, what I'm saying, know. accused of doing something. Yeah, and I told him, I was like, "I don't care, you know, you can believe what you want." <laughs> it's like, it's, it's, it. okay, fine. I was playing the game. I did play the game. But yeah. I didn't enjoy it, and I was See, miserable. That, that's that. the thing because I used to work with Easy, and um, the scheduling because you there was only supposed to be so many people off a day. Yeah, yeah. And dude, the day them kids, them guys find out the day Call of Duty has come out, that fucking day is full. Yep. Really? Flip. Yeah. And yep. Call of Duty, call, call of Duty holiday. Exactly what he just said. No the shit. Day call of Duty is just, you can't take off. Yeah. You can call in sick and use your sick time, 
And that sick time is precious. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? Well, I just use it all. <laughs> so, fuck, man. Yeah, Call of Duty, man, it, it, it's, it is a, it's viral, man. I mean, every, I, I bet you there's about 40 people on my block, my street alone, that probably already have it. Well, man, you can just hear it. People talking about it. Like, you just walk around. Especially since, like, people know I play games, you know. Mm -hmm. uh, like, somebody walked through the office today, and they're like, uh, did you get Halo 4? <laughs> and I was like, I skipped it. And he's like, you skipped it? <laughs> I, was like, I got Call of Duty instead. And he's like, ah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, wow. And I'm like, yeah, it's, you know, and it's just like the same thing I told you guys. It's, it's all right. Yeah, it's a Call of Duty game. It's fine. <laughs> I just wish they had more maps for the zombies, that's all. Yeah, yeah, I'm not. They had the season pass for Call of Duty as well, and I didn't. I got it last year because I like playing the multiplayer. Yeah, and I didn't get get it for this year. I'm not gonna get it because they're gonna probably go strictly for zombies, and I don't want to pay fifty bucks just to play zombie maps. See, that's what I want. That I'm not gonna play. So I'm <laughs> look, not, look at what they need to do is split the game up. You know, if make it a zombie Call of Duty game, if they're gonna do that. Yeah, and that's what I just said. Make it a I download said that earlier. You know. I said that earlier. I said that yeah. earlier, but they fell in love with that uh, with the Nazi zombies. When the Nazi zombie was that World at War? Yeah, yeah. that was really, yeah. really good. I put that. That's when forward. the zombie thing came about, and people been begging mm -hmm. for what is now there, the zombie campaign, the multiplayer campaign with zombies. They've been begging for this, but my thing is, like, I think that Call of Duty, eventually, eventually, this is my thought, that they're not even going to have a campaign mode because... 90% of people don't play campaign. I'm not saying yeah. anything to you, Eric. I play it. Oh, I enjoy it. I enjoy playing yeah. a storyline. But it's going to come down to that because, you know, popular demand. People want, well, we don't play the campaign. We just play multiplayer. Mm -hmm. Well, then what about the guys that do? But that's why the campaign mode, you can go through a... I went through Modern Warfare 3 in three hours. From yeah. front to back. I heard it was, it was fast. Quick. It was quick. It's quick. Yeah. They don't put that much yeah. effort yeah. into the yeah. campaign yeah. because don't nobody play it. The longevity is the multiplayer, and yeah, you know, it's just the like money's said, right there. They yeah, and it, you know it's a real shame too because the the you could tell the the art design and everything for the the story mode on the Call of Duty Black Ops Two is is pretty good. There, mm. you, you could tell there's some money there, you know. Okay. And I can't speak. That's why we got the stinky talk. I can't speak for the multiplayer. You know, how was it? Was it was it crowded? Was it laggy? I mean, I when it first no. came out, well, it was fine. It's, it's typical Black Ops style. The yeah. couple the maps first have bad, it's like that. Have bad uh, spawn points. Okay. And uh, the YouTube, like you can stream your YouTube. Well, you can yeah. live stream onto YouTube. Right? I found how to do it, but I'm, I can't get. It's like it's not working right now. It's like. Uh, I it's read not, that you need ten spectators before it'll even start. No, not even that. I gotta really. You know how you can link what? your account? Yeah, you need ten spectators before you can. Yeah. Live stream it. Mm -hmm. well, that's what that's Okay, no, wait a minute. Wait yeah. a minute. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Back up. <laughs> so, this is what I've been surfing for. I've been looking for this. That would probably be the only reason that. I would get the game is because of live streaming. But yeah. my thing is, there is a million Call of Duty commentating YouTube channels. Sure. If you've seen yeah. one, you've seen them all. You know what I mean? That's just me. I'm not hating on COD. I'm not at all. Not at all. I played Modern Warfare 3. It was okay. But I'd rather play a Treyarch than an Infinity War. Yeah, yeah. yeah. they've really turned Anybody. it around. It, it, went from, it went from, oh God, here, this year's a Treyarch game. Do oh shit! You know, Wait, we, you know, yeah, you know, it's like the best-selling one, yeah. and it, every time they make it, it just breaks new records. Yeah, and uh, it's it's because they they stop taking it as serious. Treyarch is shit. Yeah, yeah they, they, they they're having more fun with it, and you can tell. You know, it's with Modern Warfare Three, everything was so drab and just it's I don't know the story was, was just so down. Wait, you wait, know? wait, 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 drab. Drab, like, I mean, it had, yeah, like, a lot I of fun. I haven't heard that word before. Drab, really? No. It's just, like, uh, gloomy. Like, the whole thing just, like, had this heavy, heavy feeling to it, you know? It was oh, just... Okay. And so that's why I stopped playing. Like, it, it looked great. Fuck it. The production was awesome. You know, buildings and shit crumbling down on top yeah. of me and stuff, but it was just too much. 
It was just it wasn't about like the characters. Like you start playing the game, you kind of get sucked into the story. So, <clears throat> but I got I got to tell you, you know, playing the the Call of Duty, mm -hmm. yeah, it's like a yeah. grind, man. The plan I want to get through the campaign, but the I want to get through the campaign because I'm interested in what the story is. You know, it's it's kind of like yeah. got me. It's like one of those movies where you start watching and you're like, you know, you weren't really interested at first. The more you watch, the more you kind of get sucked into it. And yeah. it's like, okay, now I got to play for another 15 minutes to see right. what happens next. Right, right. Like it's always the first two or three boards you get to. It's like, you know, they're kind of taking you back. Hey, remember this? Kind of like a Back to the Future movie. You've oh. seen one. You've seen two. <laughs> you've seen three. And it's like, hey, we're going to refresh you the first 30 minutes, but then let's really get into what we're talking about. Maybe you just got to give it a little bit more time, man. Yeah. Maybe. Oh, yeah. It's it called the Black Ops, actually, you know, was pretty good. Okay. But it, still, it was every time I played the game, it's like, okay, I got to be getting close to the end. You know, it's like for, for me, it's like become like I got the achievement for it. I wanted to unlock the zombie level because after you finish the game, you unlock the, the a new zombie level that you couldn't oh. play until it was done. I think that was probably the main reason I kind of pushed through it. Okay. But yeah. The story was all right, you know. I mean, compared to like, I, I gotta be honest, I had no freaking clue what was going on in modern warfare games. None. You don't yeah. know who you're playing. You don't know who the character. You just like soap. Okay, the guy's name's Soap, and you recognize the name because you've played like the games before. Did like, they kind of jump tell around? Me what was going on? Yeah, they jumped around. Yeah, yeah that was the yeah. other thing. You had no idea you were like from you were Russia. To like uh, U.S. Yeah, or it did. Yeah, it did yeah. jump around like that. It, I had a hard time following. It did. It did. Yeah, I do remember that. So, <clears throat> I like I like Battlefield. You like Battlefield? Yeah. I don't like Battlefield. Oh my God. Have you played it? Have yeah, played I it? have. Oh, okay. okay. I just don't like how Battle, the map is. Yeah, they just there was. I mean, we talked about the 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 the, the clutteredness. With the, the the buildings falling down, the airplane, mm -hmm. the yeah. all that stuff, and you know, Frostbite Two actually did Modern uh, Medal of Honor as well, but Battlefield made you play like a soldier. You right. had to use a strategy. Mm -hmm. Okay, there's a hair, there's a helicopter above us. We can't get this objective. We got to shoot the helicopter down. There's a tank coming. We need a engineer. We need mm -hmm. a this. We need you, it made you strategize, and it's like when you play Call of Duty, and one of the most popular things is like, I think is a kill confirmed and team deathmatch. That's why yeah. I played. That's why I played all the other fun game modes like infected, you know what I mean, yeah. and stuff like that because it was fun. But there's no strategy. There's no tanks. There's no airplanes. Just let me see. Let me try to get to the top of the leaderboards. Let me just kill somebody real quick. And then yeah. get my Moab and then blow yeah. the whole fucking map up. You know what I mean? And, you know, I'm more a strategic guy. And there's a game that's coming out that I think will be my last purchase for probably a year. <laughs> <laughs> And me and my son talked about this. He actually told me the other day. Hi, son. Thank you. January 1st, 2013. Yeah. Rainbow Six Patriot. What is it? Rainbow really? Six Patriot. Oh, okay. Yeah. Ever played any Tom Clancy games? Yeah. Yeah, I love Tom. Uh, Rainbow totally Six 1 and 2. Fucking strategic. Rainbow Six you was great. You had to use your yeah. brain to Vegas play Vegas was game. good. And Patriots comes out, and the thing about Patriots, I don't want to take up too much time here. The thing about no, Patriots go for it, is, man. go for it. It's okay. Yeah, it's a video game show. We're not talking about it's <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's set in New York. Okay. Okay. Then you got these people that call themselves the Free Patriots. People are basically a um, what do you call it? A militia. Okay. They're coming and they're wiping out all the people in the White House, trying to assassinate a whole bunch of people. But basically, it's set in New York. So they're going to come out with an app that you can have on your phone yeah. to use GPS to be able to roam New York and unlock things in the game, which is crazy. On your cell phone, personal cell on phone? On your cell phone, like when you go on your cell phone. Now, for, like the, people that for the people, yeah, they're going to have an app on your phone. And it's going to tell you 
go to Queens and go to this street to unlock this gun or to unlock this achievement for the game. Really? Which wow. is that, that's crazy. That's like really deep. But for the people that don't live in New York, like I don't know if they're going to do something other than that. <laughs> what is that? That's supposed to be rain. That's a screenshot. You can't see where the shit on there. Oh though. yeah, yeah. Yeah, I didn't even hear about this game until. You just oh saw man, it. Patriots! You look at the trailer. The trailer's been out for eight months. Wow. Really? The trailer's wow. totally interactive because the guy has an iPad next to him. His yeah. wife comes. Yeah, his wife comes in, kisses him. He has to press X to kiss his wife. <laughs> he has to press B to turn his TV on. He has to press Y to pick up his iPad. And boom, in comes the door. Here comes the militia. They tie his wife up. They put a knife to her neck, and they got you tied up. I mean, the intro of the trailer is just like, I got to play this. Yeah. I'm looking at a screenshot now. It looks like a, he's yeah. overlooking the Brooklyn Bridge. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It looks yeah and all real. those cars are down there. It looks, it, the picture looks real. <laughs> Not so much the gun trailer. stuff, but when you when you actually look at the buildings, it looks like it's just somebody snapped a photo. And it's crazy. Like I remember I said, was I'd beautiful. be surprised if they uh, they made a game better, like with better graphics and shit. Maybe I'm wrong. I mean, maybe maybe they can push it just a little bit further. Call of Duty. I will say this, man. Call of Duty had the best. Walmart had the best release. What These mean, kids, like, they had. It was about. It was about 10 or 12 kid people in there when I got there. They had a tournament that started at 1030 Monday night. Okay. And they were doing the release at 12. I didn't know anything mm -hmm. about it. So yeah. it was it was 1v1. And they actually, man, they had it so fucking Like a LAN up. party? Oh, uh, no, it wasn't a LAN party. They just played on a 65. I mean, the fucking TV was huge. Yeah. Okay. It was huge. And it was it was split screen. Okay. But um, they had an Xbox set up. I'm telling you, now that I got an Xbox, I see that Xbox is the universal console. They don't even they didn't even plug up the PS3. They plugged up the Xbox. Yeah. So, um, some 16 year old kid won a free game, choice of his console, whichever console he wanted it for, a T-shirt, a poster, some patches. I mean, I was very impressed with Walmart, man, how they handled it. It was actually set up. They had cupcakes and fucking black yeah, really? napkins and wow. all types of shit. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, I was like, wow. Damn. Look at this shit. Fucking Walmart. <laughs> <laughs> you think fucking like GameStop would fucking have something like no. that out there? That's nuts. That's cool, though. That's pretty cool. They didn't have any of that shit when I waited for like, Grand Theft Auto and that. But uh, did you see the trailer for the new Grand Theft Auto? By the way? Yeah, I've seen it. I love oh, it. man. I can't really? wait for it. April, it looks sweet. Mid middle of April is coming out. Yeah, wait. you got to check it out. What? You got to check it out. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, you have to get it. You gotta I get almost want to see if I can get it on YouTube and stream it on the is show. It, but is well, that multiplayer yeah. too? Huh? Is yeah, it multiplayer? Uh, it's, I'm sure it'll have like co-op and stuff on it. Like the other one had multiplayer on it. Hmm. Um, it wasn't great, but it was kind of cool to have like, I think it was six. Maybe it was eight, you know, eight to sixteen other people in the. In yeah, the city it was. It was a little laggy though. When you yeah, it, it was. It was kind of crazy. Like, if you could get like uh, I don't know five or six people in there, it worked all right. Mm -hmm. You know, but you like don't want too were, many. Yeah, people were doing drive bys and getting the helicopter from the airport and you know blowing the shit. You kind of fun. Free play too. It's fun as hell. Yeah, the free play is what I'm talking about, it, and that's what I like to do. Like, mm -hmm. I got into these people's game one time, and they, you know, they obviously didn't want me in there because I didn't know them. And it was just like yeah. a random drop, you know. And uh, they just went after me. It was brutal. <laughs> and it was so awesome because, like, it's like the one – it was like one battlefield moment, like, where the, the helicopter's coming down on me shooting. And I had a pistol, all right? And I it, the auto-aim was turned on, thank God. But I turned the auto-aim on, and I hit the guy right in the head that was flying the helicopter. It yeah. crashed right behind me and blew up and killed everybody else. And then I left the game. You know, you want to leave on top, you yeah. know. <laughs> That's awesome. Wow. Yeah. No, the game you know, was Saints, Saints Row was like that, too. Saints Row had a multiplayer. Um, Saints Row was great. Yeah. yeah is that really Yoush? Good. Is that Yoush up there? Hmm? YouTube. YouTube. Oh, it looks like it had a. It looked like it had the Yoush logo. No, it's YouTube. Okay. Screen share. Isn't that screen share or something yeah. like that? Yeah. Yeah. Who Are you doing it, or? Uh, I guess I, guess I would Not. have to do it. 
Can you? I don't know. Let me press it. I'm scared. Yeah. To press um, it. It's out. <laughs> I clicked it. You gotta click the link to watch it. Where's the link at? The link All right. went away. It's on the left side. It says uh, Google Effects lower third YouTube screen screen share. Mm-hmm. I hit OK. I'm ready. When you're ready, Eric, to show me the video. Uh, no, I got, so I gotta click. Hold on. A second. Okay, I see it here. Okay. Uh, and there's that. There's just gonna be a little black box though, right there, isn't it? No, no black box. It's on screen share. You no, know, you go to YouTube. Oh, okay. The link. This is gotcha. YouTube. All right. Well, I tried to press it. It went away. Yeah, I didn't get anything. I just got. I'm just looking at a blank screen right now. Well, I've got the YouTube logo and. It says oh, that. YouTube. Okay, I see yeah. it in there. Okay. Drum roll. Dun, 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 dun. Okay. Okay. Yeah. That must have been a new feature. Or something I never seen that. Well, I knew it was on there, but I with my old computer, it was it was be like kicking it in the balls. So I was no not even gonna try it. Not even try it. Yeah. Yeah. All right, man. You said there's a link. Now, forgive me. Where's the link at? Because I don't see it. I just I clicked on YouTube. Do you want me to do it? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, you do it. Then. You do it. Well, so go ahead. And play. Yeah, I'm not fucking with it. Yeah, you do it. Yeah. All right. Let's see. Well, how do I get back to my other shit? <laughs> like, All right, I got it right here. Let's see. I guess go ahead and. I just clicked on you know one of one of your guys' pictures and it back. Oh okay, there it is. Yeah, I guess you're right. <clears throat> yeah, is my uh, is my bottom part there where it says games we play? Is that backwards or is that just on mine? It yeah, it looks backwards to you, but we see it. All right, good. Yeah. Right, right, yeah, good. Professionals. <laughs> All right, let's see. You guys, I'm screen uh, sharing. I just probably you just probably have to click his box then, huh? Yeah. yeah what? I ain't touching his box. <laughs> All right. Yeah. No sound though. Uh, it's a little laggy but too. It's all right. right. It's all right. Yeah. You can see the see the graphics and stuff. Oh wow! Yeah. Is he part of the mob or something? Uh, the story goes, from my understanding, he's an ex bank robber. Yeah. And he's out of the game. And they're getting he's getting sucked back in. But oh. you play uh there's three different protagonists. There's there's this guy, this guy's a loose cannon supposedly. And the other guy is is a kid, it looks like, he's a younger kid, it looks like he's just starting out. Mm -hmm. And my understanding is you can jump from any character whenever you want. Um, different characters have a different skill sets that'll help you like solve different things and uh, you know, be better for different heists. They say it's supposed to be like a a lot of it's supposed to be like a heist it, movie. It's gonna be a new one. It's gonna be a new Grand Theft Auto, not based off San Andreas. Right, right. So they're not gonna have any characters chapter. at all from from the oh, old okay. ones. Um, but they are gonna have characters from four. I didn't play that one at all. Oh, really? Yeah, I stopped at uh, I stopped at the three. I think no, San Andreas was the last one I stopped. Yeah, at. that was the best one. Yeah, four was all right. Man, this looks good. Yeah. Hmm. I can hear some sound a little bit. It must be coming yeah, through somebody's a feedback. Okay. Yeah, that part's awesome where he's on the train. Wow. Can't wait. This is going to be huge. So this is probably definitely going to be on two discs, then, huh? Um, I don't know if it, can they do it two discs. They say it's supposed to be. Did you play Red Dead Redemption? Uh, yeah. I oh. I played. Undead Nightmare and the original. Okay. All right. That was good. At least not a screen share. <laughs> yeah. It's supposed to be like six times larger. The map's supposed to be six times yeah. larger oh than Red Dead Redemption. Yeah. yeah, I, I love remember. Red Dead. It's the only game I beat. I oh, love it. that game's awesome. And I still, I've, I've beat it, but there's like still missions after you, you, you finish that? it that have to do it with your family. Yeah, yeah. I beat it. Like, you can, uh, I got the additional map packs. I got Rocks out of deal a while back. I believe they Blues L.A. Noir, and they wanted people to buy the packs and maps. Yeah. And they had Dales and the old stuff, so I got the uh, stuff for uh, Red Dead Redemption, mm -hmm. like the Nightmare Pack. It's like, kill Bigfoot. So I'm running around, yeah. 
Yeah, I found, I found two so, Sasquatches. I did. Trying try to kill Bigfoot. And the thing freaking comes after me and balls my face off. <laughs> hey, don't fuck I around, like, man. It, I think it hell? talked to me, too. Once yeah, I he started. did. He talked. He talked, if I remember yeah. right. Yeah. Yeah. He was like, why are you hunting me, you son of a bitch? You know, yeah, it's like, yeah. you've killed all my, you know, I'm the only one left or something like that. It was along those lines. But he yeah, did talk. Uh, yeah, but that game was great. Just I like, loved it. I beat it in two days. Two it, days. Wow. Oh, man. You, yeah, you got me. It took me a couple months, but... I wasn't yeah, playing it like every day. Maps I would get sucked huge. into that game though, and you know I'd be on that fucker for like six hours. You know, Beth would be like, "Are you almost done?" And I'm like, "I've only been playing for an hour." She's like, "Dude, it's like fucking dinner time. <laughs> You've been sitting here <laughs> for five hours." Yeah, because yeah. it was it was a lot of traveling on that game. Like you yeah. got on a horse and you, yeah, you had to though. That's how the game was. There's always Grand Theft Auto when you can fly on a plane or yeah. drive a car. Yeah. The only time I ever used the carriage is if I had like was in uh, one of the main towns and then had to go to Mexico. Yeah. That was a haul. You know, but any other time man, the game was just so good looking you just and there was shit that you would come across as you were riding your horse through the desert or whatever. Yeah. It, it was fun. It, it, yeah, was, it right. was really fun. The combat was great. And just and the fact that it's six times larger and it's going to be a city instead of like just open fields. Oh my that's, god, man! What the, that's know, crazy. It's going to be slums, you know. From th- looks to things, they got like fields see, that are growing and it, produce, and, and, and it's an open world. It yeah. doesn't take you down memory lane, and that's the only way that you can go. Like you can yeah. just go wherever. And hopefully, it'll be like uh, four, where the whole map's just open. You know, like in the old games. You were, you only you had, had like unlocking. yeah they yeah. had some problem with the bridge yeah, or some shit like yeah. that you couldn't get over there but yeah the fourth one I think was completely unlocked whenever you got it. So. Hmm. What else? <laughs> Not. Ah uh, yeah. Uh, I am going to buy my Avid Media Player this Friday. I know. Well, next Friday, not this Friday. Next Friday, PGA. Mm-hmm. Kwame, this is the week. I don't buy any more games. This is the week. I gotta hey. stream some Call of Duty because I had to pay some bills and stuff. So I got this next paycheck. I put 60 to 80 hours on this paycheck because we got paid hmm. every two weeks. I'm gonna buy that media player, and the only thing I'll be doing is going to the bathroom, going to school, going to work, come home, stream some video games, like hmm. every now, game I have. Now that you say the S word, streaming, stream. We never really figured out like. What, what did you guys say? You have to have 10 viewers before you stream? Like, how do you yeah, do that? Like, yeah. No, well, my buddy said before you, like, you have to go into league play because they have two versions of the multiplayer. League play where you have to rank up with your clan to get higher and to play people. Which I'm not going to do that anyways. That's the only way you can stream. You got to uh, use this league play and uh, you can stream through it, but you have to, like, he got a prompt that said you gotta click this link, and uh, that, that scared the crap out of me. Uh, you gotta <laughs> click this link, and uh, it pops up. You can uh, attach this input to your YouTube account. You know how it asks you to for permission, like gives you a little code to put in. I never got that code. And all I'm getting every time I hit the live stream button well, is it's, the agree button. So it's, I don't it's, know. The same, it's the same thing as going on your Xbox and downloading YouTube. And it asks you to link so you be able to get into your YouTube page from Oh, yeah. The I Xbox. should download YouTube again because I, I, I think messed up. Is it even through YouTube? I thought it was for somebody else. Yeah, it's it through is. YouTube, through third party, I think. Oh, okay. All right. That's why I'm very, very tempted not to do it because I don't want my YouTube channel to go bye bye. You know what I mean? It's just me. Why would it go bye bye? Yeah, why, why would it do that? I don't know. I don't trust anybody. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. But yeah, I'm going to. <laughs> Probably hop off soon to play some Call of Duty if you want to join me, Eric. Yeah, well, I'm. I I probably won't be on tonight because I pretty much had to give the TV over to the wife. Oh. But uh, tomorrow, I'll be All playing right. Borderlands. You hop on. I'll uh, I'll play. I'll play some you, Call of what's Duty. What's that thing behind you? You got a TV there. That's uh oh. That's not hooked up to the internet though. That Xbox is like in one of the old ones, and I'm not paying. I'm not paying like ninety dollars or sixty dollars, whatever it is, for an adapter for it when I'm I'm hardly going to use it. Oh, yeah, yeah, there's a uh, the PlayStation works though. You got a PlayStation Three? I see a Wii. Yeah, there's definitely a Wii. Wii U. Com- oh yeah, how the hell did we forget this? Wii U oh, comes Wii out U. Sunday. Yeah. yeah oh wow. 
Oh yeah, so. yeah. I I had to put them away at work. I'm like, how many people are be fighting over these? Oh, things? you've got them already. You've seen them. I've seen them. I don't like wow. them. It's too small. Yeah, I'm not interested. Me at all. You know, and I waited for the Wii, and I'm I'm done. I'll wait. Mm. You know I'll what? Wait. Though I had an idea, and I don't know if we'd be able to pull it off. I wouldn't mind like going to the lines, like a Best Buy or some place like that, and actually like interviewing people for the show and shit. That'd wow. be cool. But the problem is, like, I've noticed. <laughs> That you can't really stream over 3G, <laughs> it won't let you do it. I, the the app just won't even recognize that I have a notification. Wow! So I thought it'd be kind of cool to like. I don't know if you guys ever waited in line for a console before. Yeah, no. But the camaraderie, uh, camarad, what's the word? Camaraderie. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Um, is great. It's just like everyone wants to talk about games. It's like one big live podcast show. I guess you're right. You know. Yeah. And, you know, everyone has their own opinions. It's just like when I waited for the 360, that was one of the greatest waits ever. You know, that went, I waited for like 12 hours for that. Wow. Really? And, uh, you, yeah. Where huh? did you go to the bathroom? Um, actually, I had a friend with me that actually saved my place. And really? it was by the layaway. I mean, it was, it was in the store. It wasn't like outside. When I waited for the PlayStation 3, it was outside. Really? Oh. That was a camping trip. Did you did you have to have a card or something to get one, or did you just get you, one? You you get in line, and most people don't argue. Like whoever's there first is there first. It, like my experience has been fairly good, and once you get there and you hold your place, most people like don't argue. You know, like that's Eric's number yeah. thirteen, you know, or fourteen. And I when I got there for the Xbox, there was only one more left. So like right. I was, I think I was like twelve, and there was thirteen consoles. And then they they had like the remember when they had the oh, what wow. was it, the premium or whatever it was where yeah, they had the silver yeah, tray yeah. and then the the regular base the arcade they didn't have the hard drive yeah they didn't have the hard drive well they only had so many of the premiums which were going to be gone you know so I already just assumed that I was going to get an arcade skew which was fine whatever I just was glad to have one then um, but you got there and that was it you know and you. You pretty much talk to everybody. You get to know everybody for 12 hours. You know, you're all sitting around. Eventually, you're going to get bored of yeah. talking to somebody and go to somebody else, or it's yeah. just going to be one big conversation. And, and there's before 3G cell phones, too. So yeah. how the hell did you do it? <laughs> I, I had a PSP, so I uh, I played the PSP. Mm -hmm. died. That was probably one of the only times I played the PSP. <laughs> um, what else? That was about it, man. We just shot the shit, and, uh, yeah, you're right. There was no 3G. That would have... Now I think about it, that'd be rough. I don't know how I could handle that now, because like yeah. anytime I get bored, I pop out that phone and I'm like whatever, surfing the web or checking the news, something like that. Um, but for the place, to, the next Xbox, man, I'm gonna be camping out for that. Oh wow! I wonder what when, when is that? Uh, it'll be next year, I'm sure. I'm gonna get when they have the pre-release cards to Target. I'm gonna get one. Yeah. Like I'm gonna buy one, so I'm gonna have yeah. one. I'm gonna get one when it comes out. Yeah. Well, you've got the yeah. advantage, man. You need nope, to. Nope, I don't. You need to. Hook, you don't. You can't do that. Nope. Well, that's horse shit. <laughs> he yeah. can. He can. Look at his face. Yeah. No, oh, we don't do that. <laughs> no, I don't do it. All right. I, I, think, I, I think I'm going to hop off watch some Call of Duty. My ass is burning in the seat. Is it? Dude, yeah. your ass is burning. I've been shitting straight for like fucking two days. <laughs> Get, get I wish I'd in invested place. in some better toilet paper. I gotta tell you that right now. Hmm. What's that have to do with this? Over your ass after you wipe. Well, yeah, you wipe all the. Uh, all right, <laughs> yeah. get... that's for a different podcast. <laughs> yeah, we gotta end it. All right, I'm <laughs> Eric's <out of> ass <laughs> cast. <laughs> all right. <laughs> all right. Well, we wrapping it up then. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See you later. See you guys. Take care. All right. Day. See you. Bye. See ya. Bye.